All right, now I'm gonna break this Spence Crawford thing down section by section, video by video. Next up, y'all got a lot to say about Terrence Bud Crawford opposition. Let me first just say, as a boxing fan, I'm not happy with this opposition because I want to see this fight next, okay? So let it be known where I stand. But since we talk about opposition, talking about, see, this is what we talking about. Why Terrence Bud Crawford can't fight somebody like this? Why can't he go fight a Keith Thurman, uh, a Ortiz, a, you know what I'm saying? Uh, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, he can pick somebody better than this, 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 that, and the third, right? 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 The only thing that I request is that you keep that same energy. You know what I'm saying? So what y'all got to say about this? This is what I want to know. And how many casual boxing fans know who this guy is? Huh? Huh? Is we keeping it real or not? Let me know now. Let me know. I, I can feel y'all backpedaling right now. <laughs> I can feel it. Right now. You know what I'm saying? Stan Leonis, who knows who the fuck that is? You know what I'm saying? But besides somebody who really watches boxing, and even then, but is this a star-studded name that y'all talking about? Okay, because if Crawford did this or was fighting this dude, you guys would have the same reaction. Am I right or am I wrong? Because y'all like to say I'm not down the middle. You know what I'm saying? I know exactly what I am. And if I wasn't down the middle, and if I was biased, guess what? You know, Bruce is arrogant enough and cocky enough to tell you that and ask you to do something about it. You know what I'm saying? And no, I ain't talking about no physical shit. I'm, 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 you know what I'm saying? I'm just talking that shit. But I'm saying, if I was that way, I think everybody knows that I wouldn't hide it. I would let it be well known. Okay, but I'm keeping it even fucking Steven. But let's be real here. If Terrence Crawford was to fight Errol Spence opposition, you guys would say the same thing. You know you would. And this is what I'm going to end it with. These Errol sexuals are acting like if he beats Errol Spence, they're going to be like, up, oh, I stand corrected, but it's that guy. We know that's not going to happen. We know you're not going to get that man his credit. Terrence Crawford can do nothing in you guys' eyes, which you'd be like, you know what? He's better than what I thought. I didn't give him enough credit. I overlooked him. You know what I'm saying? I've been a little sour on the kid. You know? You guys are not going to do that. Remember, y'all begged for him to fight Corey. He fought Porter. And what they say, y'all? It's a fixed fight. It's always gonna be like that. This man can't do no right in their eyes. So that's why their opinion and what they say, it does not matter to the real boxing fan. It don't matter to us because the guy can never do right. He will never do anything where y'all would basically get off his back and give him his credit. We know that. When and if he stops Spence, y'all not going to give him credit. Y'all going to come up with excuses. Y'all know that. That's why I made that video ahead of time. Let me know ahead of time if there's any excuses that you're going to come up with. Let me hear them now because I don't want to hear them the day that Errol Spence lose. That's exactly why I made that video. So they can't come back and do that at all. But y'all know y'all would have the same energy if these two guys swapped opponents. Y'all know that, man. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm out.